Good evening again, Mr. President and Council. Uh, I resign on 759 East Linden Avenue, just what Commissioner just got you talking about. And I took it up on my own to cut the grass on that blocked off street where people's been dumping at. And that's the street that the government, governor gave us certain amount of days to clean it up or he gonna mess it up for other wards. Your ward in particular. I thought my ward was May's ward, but they said, crossing to the missioner, he said, that's your ward, sir, Mr. President. But in this, in the park, it's so huge, every time they cut the grass, the people get outdone when they grow so fast, they shoot bullets inside the, the school with the preacher in it. They stay over in with high-powered rifles, and, and every time they fix the window, and two weeks later, they shoot it up again. That's a house style them Audrey Park has become. People from Audrey Village and all that stuff act like he's a Reverend Martin Luther King getting in the way of the garbage people. Put him up first and blow the preacher man head off from a Georgia. There ain't no be no more killing preachers around here no more. Just cause you, Mr. President, act like you ain't concerned. And all you uppity people up uptown, like Miss Galloway and Davidson, all that drunk and, and Miss Phil and Miss Popular, look at him walking out trying to break up the form and drunk. And, and I want you to know I want, I want some reverse when, when y'all start marching Saturday with some money, man. You got that? Now take that straight up with that politics. And another thing about this mayor from Burton. When I first moved in Burton, I got the first apartment out there behind my ears. And the commissioner said, hey, young, she said, young man, I, she, she called my pay and they took me up. I got out of Burton because I built a church out there. They didn't want my church. It's still out there. I was trying to figure out how can I go live in Flint to go to Burton. And I've been there, I've been there talking no more because can't get to the Vatican and church mixed up with this government stuff. Like these concerned pastors. Okay, next speaker. Next speaker is Mr. Arthur.